going to show you how to uh, configure an axis in Mach 3, uh, how to enable it, reverse the direction, and change the home direction. All right, the first thing to do to set up an axis is to make sure it's enabled. So we'll go to Config, then Ports and Pins, and then go to Motor Outputs. So here we can see the list of all of the axes, which ones are enabled and which ones aren't. So today we'll set up the x-axis. So it's already enabled, and on mock motion controls, we will have default parameters already set up. So this is set up for the Apollo 1 board with all the port and pin addresses pre-assigned. So like I said, it's enabled, so we're done here. We can close that. Um, next, we'll come over here to config again, then homing slash limits. And the homing limits window here controls the direction that the axis will move as well as the direction that it will home. So here in the first column we've got the x-axis and the uh, reverse column. So if you set up your machine, you've jogged it back and forth since it's enabled and you're seeing that it's jogging the opposite direction than you want, we just go to the reverse column on x and check it so it's a green check and that will reverse the direction so it will jog the right way. So now you've tested it out, you are homing it, and it's going the opposite ends of the table that you want. So you come over here to the home negative column and check that, and that will send it the opposite direction for homing. Hit OK, and that will save your changes. Now you know how to enable reverse uh, motion direction and homing direction on each axis. If you'd like to see more, you can watch our other videos or visit us at mockmotion.com.